In this video, we're going to focus on log multiplication. It's one of those math techniques that you've learned in school. Let's start with a simple example. What is 39 times 8? But what we need to do is multiply 8 by 9 first. 8 times 9 is 72. So we're going to write the 2 and then carry over the 7. Next, we need to multiply 8 times 3. 8 times 3 is 24. And then you need to add 7 to 24. 24 plus 7 is 31. So the answer for this example is 312. Let's try another example. What is 56 times 9? Go ahead and try that one. So we have 9 times 6, which is 54. So we're going to write the 4 first, carry the 5. And then 9 times 5 is 45, plus the 5, that's 50. So the answer for this example is 504. Now let's try an example that is a little bit harder. Let's multiply 46 by 27. If you want to try it yourself, feel free to pause the video and work on it. So let's begin by multiplying 7 by 6. 7 times 6 is 42. So we're going to write the 2, carry over the 4. Next, we have 7 times 4, which is 28. And then we need to add 4 to 28. So 28 plus 4 is 32. Next, we're going to multiply 6 times 2, which is 12. Oh, before we do that, by the way, we need to write a 0. And then we can multiply 6 times 2, which is 12. We'll write the 2 and then carry over the 1. Next, we have 2 times 4, which is 8, and then plus 1, that's 9. So now we need to add these two numbers. 2 plus 0 is 2, 2 plus 2 is 4, 3 plus 9 is 12. So the answer is 1,242. Now, if you were confused by that example, let me give you another one that's similar. For the sake of practice, you can try it. Let's multiply 76 by 52. So we're going to start with 2 times 6. 2 times 6 is 12. Let's write the 2 first and then carry over the 1. And then 2 times 7 is 14 plus 1. That's 15. Now, let's write a 0. 5 times 6 is 30. So we're going to write a 0, carry over the 3. And then 5 times 7 is 35 plus 3. That's 38. And now we need to add. So this is going to be 2, 5, 8 plus 1 is 9, and then we have a 3. So it's 3,952. That's the answer. Let's try a more challenging example. Let's multiply 369 by 43. Go ahead and work on that. So we have 3 times 9, which is 27. So we'll write the 7, carry over the 2. 3 times 6 is 18, plus 2, that's 20. So we'll write the 0, carry over the 2. 3 times 3 is 9, plus 2, that's 11. Now, let's add a 0. And then we have 4 times 9, which is 36. We'll carry the 3. 4 times 6 is 24, plus 3, that's going to be 27. Carry over the 2. 4 times 3 is 12, plus 2. That's 14. So now we need to add. So we have 7, 6, 1 plus 7 is 8, 1 plus 4 is 5. And so the answer is going to be 15,867. So this is going to be the final example. It's going to be the hardest one that we've worked on in this video. Multiply 759 by 438. So first we have 8 times 7, I mean 8 times 9 rather. 8 times 9 is 72. Write the 2 and then carry over the 7. Next is 8 times 5. 8 times 5 is 40. Add 7, that's 47. So we're going to write the 7, carry over the 4. And then 8 times 7 is 56, plus 4, that's 60. Now, add a 0. 
3 times 9 is 27. So write the 7, carry the 2. 3 times 5 is 15. Plus 2, that's 17. So let's write the 7, carry the 1. And then 3 times 7 is 21. Plus 1, that's 22. Now we're going to write two zeros instead of one before we go into uh, the fours. So 4 times 9 is 36. Let's carry over the 3. 4 times 5 is 20, plus 3, that's 23. Let's write the 3 and then carry over the 2. 4 times 7 is 28, plus 2, that's 30. So we're just going to write 30 at this point. And now we can add. So we have 2, and then 7 plus 7 is 14. We need to write the 4, carry the 1. And then we have 1 plus 7 plus 6. 1 plus 7 is 8, 8 plus 6 is 14. So let's write 4, carry over the 1. Then we have 1 plus 6, which is 7. 7 plus 3 is 10. 10 plus 2, that's 12. And then 2 plus 1 is 3. And then we can write the other 3. So the final answer is 332,442. So now you know how to multiply two numbers using long multiplication.